a nice fit suit. Dozens of churches across Tiverton will be joining St Paul's in offering food for the community. The Lunch to Go scheme has been set up not only to feed those who may be struggling during the current lockdown, but also to provide a social aspect and a warm welcome. We began last Christmas, um, just before Christmas, we have started with a breakfast on the go, providing hot porridge and um, bacon rolls in the mornings. And that's just kind of grown into lunch on the go as well, where we provide hot soup and tea and coffee and just the opportunity for people to just have a chat when they walk past and and something hot to um, warm us in in these winter times and of course because of the pandemic that's kind of stopped and started a little bit but we've restarted that again because we just recognize there is great need out there not just for um, soup and, and and tea and coffee but just a friendly face just how vital has it been and, and how does it feel now that this scheme is going to be expanded to other churches and centres across the town? Well, we're, we're excited about that really. Um, uh, um, we just recognise that there is great need out there and um, in conjunction with a number of other churches in, in around this area, um, we'll work alongside and set up some locations around Tiverton and, and, um, and hopefully reach out to, to, to people and, uh, and provide a friend, friendly face and uh, um, welcoming hot drink. The scheme is being part funded by Tiverton Town Council, with coordination being supported by the Tiverton Volunteer Force, who have been kept busy helping others during the pandemic. There's a big concern, although uh, a lot of people are in lockdown, there's also people that just generally haven't got the money to be able to afford food, um, or, or they're not getting out to get it. So um, the church of St, St, St Paul's and St George's decided to kind of set up this lunch on the go. Um, we've come down today to have a look around and then hopefully replicate it on a number of um, locations across Tiverton over the next few weeks, just so that people aren't, aren't hungry. Just how important is it that these schemes are going ahead and what can we expect for the future now? I think it's really important, you know, a lot of people are on reduced um, incomes. Um, I think the problem with it is that a lot of people are kind of too scared to say that actually they're struggling at home with finances. Um, so the more we can get that out there and say actually, you know, there, there isn't a problem. You know, if, if you need food, there's no reason for anyone to be hungry today. Um, we've, we've got chat in the, in the town uh, that you can contact. Uh, they run the, the food bank. There's also community fridges. Um, and there's also a number of locations across Tiverton where um, a lot of the local supermarkets will donate food um, for free. And then just members of the community and public can go and pick that up. So if you're out and about doing your shopping or doing your daily exercise and you see one of these pop-up cafes, make sure to come and say hello. Come and have some soup or a nice cup of tea. It'll definitely warm you up in these winter months. And hopefully the social aspect of it will help you get through lockdown. Lewis Clark for Devon Live in Tiverton.